from New York. Ebro in the morning. On Hot 97. Your loved one's dreams gets on your goddamn nerves. <laughs> it's tough, Hi, man. Hello, good morning, Lauren. Hang on one second. But it's Hi. tough because you love them. You love them. You they have dreams. Them. You want to support them, but it's in your house. Mm -hmm. So every day while you're trying to plan your future and get your stuff together, your loved one is like, yeah, but you know when I do X, Y, Z and you want to be like, it's not happening. It's never going to work. Shut up. It's not going to work. Lauren's on the phone. Your loved one wanted to be what? A music producer. Oh. Yeah. He turned our finished basement into a studio. Okay. We have kids, so we had no place to put their toys. He'd have all his friends come over. Yeah, nothing ever happened from it. Are you guys still together? We're not anymore. <laughs> well, did, did, this but, did this contribute to the breaking up? Well, he would spend a lot of money on the equipment and all of that stuff. I mean, so financial, of course, is a piece, but that wasn't ultimately the reason. Mm. But I'm, I'm but sure... The equipment's a lot of money. <laughs> yeah, I'm it's sure it It's very expensive, help. yeah. Shawnee Culture, have you figured out how old your buddy is that thinks he's still going to the NBA? No, nah, not exactly. I think he's somewhere between 30, 31 and like 35. Wow. It's right. a big difference. But it's a, it is a big difference. It's four years, but it is a big difference in the NBA. Now, well, he's it's a big, married. It's a, when you're in your 30s and you get to your 40s, those that 30s changes, yeah. man. There's a big difference between yeah. 30 and 35. 35 and 40. Those are, that's a major difference. Yeah, yeah. Physically. Yeah. Well, I mean, like, he's married. He has a kid. Um, he's been in the NBA. He feels like he can make it back. And I think, you know, his wife is trying to support him, but not too happy and doesn't know how to... Tell them stop. It's rough because even in my case, like I told you, but my friend, they're both, they both worked in, you know, in, in the fashion industry. He decided to break out and start his own like, fashion Break out, line. like quit his job. Quit his job, Whoa. everything. So she's been holding down the household trying to be, she's like, I love my husband, I want to support him. But it's been like five years and his clothing line is going nowhere. And she's like, I can't handle everything. It's like everything is on her lap. <sighs> And she's man. like, she doesn't know how to break it to him. Like, yo, you got to get a job, man. Sometimes you got to hold the L, man. I thought I was going to be in an R&B group. Oh, uh, <laughs> you mean um, Planets? Uh, what was it? Alive. Tomorrow's Answer. Tomorrow's, Tomorrow's Answer. answer. Planet, okay. L, it wasn't Planet happening, Liquidity man. Was my thing. Sorry. I, Shawnee was in PU. I yeah. thought you were in PU, Planet, PU. Planets Align. It's Tomorrow's Answer. Tomorrow's, tomorrow's answer, answer, man. And the answer was no. no. The answer was hell no. <laughs> yeah. No more. Tomorrow's I also thought now. I was going to the NFL. Had college letters, was going to Cal Berkeley to play mm. football, was, you know, boom, was popping. Showtime. Yeah, nah. <laughs> nah, right? Yeah, nah. <laughs> your knee don't work no more. Go your sit niece, down, remix Your knee it. said nah. Yeah, knee said nah. Damn. But you got to hold these L's. You got to know when to fold them. Yes. Walk no. away. Mm. Sometimes run. Sometimes run. Run. Like uh, Diana. Diana in Bayport, you were right. dating a guy. What did your loved one? He wanted to do what? He wanted to be a professional wrestler all of his life. <laughs> hey. oh, okay. Like all right. I respect it. Until what Look, age? I want to say like 27, 26. He just kind of stopped. He got into a car accident. He mm. couldn't really wrestle anymore. Well, yeah, mm. there's that part. Well, he was still plugging so, away, but, though, in his late 40s. He was still hoping it might happen. Yeah, well, if you, to be perfectly honest, if you look at most wrestlers nowadays, they don't make it to that age because your body goes through so much damage. Right. But he was good. Like, he was really good. I completely supported him. I mean, it got on my nerves a lot because, like, we, I made a lot of sacrifices. But at the same time, like, if that's his dream, if that's what he wanted, like, if you think you got it, and I thought he got it. Well, here's so, the thing. And no, I, she's a rider, I mean, though. Yeah, we got to show is. up for she a rider. Got, but here's the thing. I'm willing to ride for somebody's dreams if you can take care of your primary responsibilities and then on the side do your dreams. Mm -hmm. I'm with you. But when you start yeah. abandoning your primary responsibility or you think that you don't have a primary responsibility, go mm -hmm. out and get a job mm -hmm. because you're still chasing this dream, mm -hmm. now that's when I have a problem. I'll give I'll give him that. He always held down his job. Well, there you go. He right. hated All his right. job, but That's he always fine. held it down. But the thing was, is that it got to the point, and we we were friends for years, and just kind of started dating. We were together for like three years, but he started putting all of his dreams. On me, like it was my responsibility. Yeah, to nah, help him get nah, in there. nah. And after a while, mm. I'm like, I, I 
can't do this no more. Like, I can't do this anymore. Plus, oh, if you're not going to make the actual sacrifices to get your dream, like, if you're not going to put your foot down and even fight for it, even if you got it, then what's the, what's the point? What's there the point? Is. You're wasting um, everyone's time. Thank you, Diana. Wait, was she try- was he trying to be an Olympian or WWE? No, 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 no professional. WWE. WWE. Ah. Mm-hmm. He was going to choke slam and hit people with tables. Oh, nice. I how like much it. money do those people coming up make? Shorts. Coming up, it's tough. Like how tough. much? $25? Well, I mean, it can be It can be that. It could be $200. It could be nothing. It Thank could you. be, if, you, if WWE signs you to an NXT contract, well, then you actually might you know make a nice salary to go. Like what's a nice salary? I NXT think, contract. I bet NXT people are making like, you know, 70, 80 grand. Okay. Maybe, okay. you know, and go down to Florida and your whole life is training. But that's getting to a high. That means you're good and young and have potential and star power. And you're moving to Florida. Yep, power. and you're moving to Florida. And how often are you on the road? Well, you spend most of your time in Florida and, and without not and not moving around. Once you're, when you go to train. But I'm talking about Ebro, that doesn't happen. It's like minor league baseball. It's like that, by the way, we got to hear from someone in that. That one's tough because there are people who make minors in baseball, right? They come out of college, they play minor league baseball, play in single A for a few years, play double A, maybe make it a triple A, go back to double A, and they turn around, they're 32, they've never gotten a shot at, at Major Griff League Baseball. Griff said it happened to his best friend. Yeah, you. Uh, th- I knew someone, my ex-girlfriend's brother was like that, just never... And then you go to the independent leagues. Yeah, then like, you might play in another league. Yeah. But how come these people don't just be like, you know what, I'm going to go into sports medicine, I'm a coach... Mm-hmm. I'm gonna because it's the dream. Your passion, yeah, it's your passion. Yeah, it's your it's dream. You gotta hold this L. Yeah, that's yo. It's you say easy. that like it's way too easy. It's I not know, easy. Right? It's not easy. I cried many nights when tomorrow's answer didn't come together. No, <laughs> <laughs> after we performed at the BET joint, you know what I mean. Sherry Carter was there. You know what I mean. I was up there hand singing. Doing my light skin footsteps like I'll be sure I was getting it in. It wasn't the answer. But it, it, it didn't, it didn't come together. You gotta hold this out. 